Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. I am so excited to like be doing this solo video. I'm gonna, okay, so last week we talked about burnout and we discussed that we you know might want to change up how we do YouTube. And we have decided that Tuesdays are really gonna be like me day, like it's gonna be like clothes or hair or something like that. And on Fridays we'll do the vlogs with both me and Paul. We're gonna mix it up a little bit. We're still like new to this, we're still figuring it out. So it may change again, but for now I'm really excited to be doing this video today. And <laughs> I'm really excited to tell you what I'm doing. So in today's video, it's just me and I'm doing a haul of all the things that I got from Ivy Park. I am so excited that Beyonce decided to include us plus size girls this time around. Um, I got like way more than I actually thought I did. Like when I actually opened the boxes, I was like, hmm. I ordered kind of a lot and I am grateful that I was able to get what I got. I know some people struggled with the drop and like figuring out, like, I don't know. I was able to order with like no problem and I know that was not the experience of a lot of people so I am grateful and I'm excited to share with you like what I got and also just to show like the fit on a plus size body. Um, I wear a size 22 on the bottoms, like a 20 on top so it's 2x on top, 3x on bottom and hopefully if you're a similar size you can kind of like gauge how it may fit you especially if you're a hippie girl like me. So I'm gonna try on everything that I got and let's let's do this. It's my first haul, cute. Okay, so this is the first look that I'm gonna try on. I felt like it was the most basic and like actually active wear, like actually something that I want to work out in, not necessarily like streetwear, right? So these are, this is the sports bra. I'm wearing a size 2X and the leggings are a 3X. I, okay, when I first put on the sports bra, I was like, mm -mm, this isn't going to work. Because <laughs> the way that the straps crisscross in the back and then come and hook here, I kind of assumed that the way it looks, it looks like my boobs weren't gonna fit. I have an H cup, so they're pretty big. Um, but once everything was strapped in and secure, I'm actually, I feel really like solid. I would say this is like a medium impact sports bra. Like maybe not like sprinting, but I could definitely like go hiking in this. I could definitely go and like lift weights and do any of that kind of stuff. Cycling, good to go. And I'm really grateful for that. So. This has a pretty good hold and a pretty good fit, and I'm really excited about this. This has a lot of stretch here in the band, and so it's actually really comfortable around the neck. And this little strip feels a little weird, but looks cute. So overall, this sports bra is definitely a win. Like, I really like the fit. I like the support. It's comfy. It's cute. And yeah, I would definitely buy the black version that's coming out today. Um, let's talk about these leggings. Big fan. Like like these more than the sports bra already. Um, I love that they have the long pockets, like enough room for all the things that you might need. The mesh is cute, but not like itchy. I've had, you know, leggings in the past where they have mesh inserts and it's like kind of weird and like an itchy feeling. This is like pretty high quality. I feel really good about it. I like the fit. There is plenty of room for this, <laughs> you know? Like there's not um, that like, dip in the back that I have to worry about and I love that this is a it's firm but it's not too tight like I feel like anyone who I don't know for me in my belly I like it to feel secure but I like it to still feel like there's a good amount of hold and I feel that way with these still lots of stretch so if you're shaped differently than me like if you were more belly heavy than hip heavy I think you're all good to go and yeah these feel pretty true to size I like the length I like the feel and the fit. These are a win. I definitely would buy these in black so that I could wear them more often, you know? Not that I won't wear the green as often, but I still feel like I'd wear leggings that are black way more often. I'm gonna pause real fast to show you the shoes. I'm not gonna put them on because I'm going to keep them and they make me happy, but I'll show you the close-ups. These are the sneakers I got. Nope. So cute. So 
suede. I love the neon on the inside. I think that's super cool. And then there's this detail in the back here with this little squiggly shoelace. It reminds me of the ones that you have as kids when you don't know how to tie your shoes. <laughs> um, but they're really pretty. And I don't, I don't know, I might end up wearing them. But they are pretty. Okay, so next up are these bicycle shorts. I saw these on the site and I love them so much. I don't even wear bicycle shorts like that, but I, I needed these. I love the band. I love the mesh. I love the fit. Like, I'm really impressed with the fit on these. I think when brands don't necessarily start with plus size and then go to plus size after, I'm always a little worried about fit, but I feel like they did a really good job. The only place that's like not perfect for me is right around here. But I have really like thick thighs. Like that is where I carry my weight. So I don't love how it fits me here. Um, I've had bicycle shorts that either are a little bit longer so you don't like get the like cut here or are like a little bit looser so that it doesn't like dig into the sides as much. So that's not my favorite part of, or like it's like the one thing I don't like love love about these. Other than that I'm gonna wear them around my house all the time. <laughs> Super cute. If you are a bicycle short person I feel like this is a good look for you. They do dip a little bit lower than the leggings do. They're not as high waisted. Um, they're cute, man. I like them. <laughs> I feel like, yeah, I feel like these are the ones I'll wear around my house. Not necessarily wear out like that, but I really like them. Okay, so I kept on the shorts, but I added this crew neck and the beanie. I, I if, if Beyonce is known for anything, I feel like she's known for like the details. And I love all the little details in this sweatshirt. It's technically one of their unisex um, pieces, but I love just like the branding all the way through and through. If you look close here, we have the stripes. We have the stripes. We have this cute little pocket that is like sewed shut so you can like rip it open and actually have a pocket. I am going to keep it sewn because I like how it lays flat, especially like here. You know, like you don't want it to be like bulgy on one side or the other, but like, I am such a fan of the fit. I, the, the bottom is like, even has elastic in it. So it, like if you are more hippie like me and it feels a little tight, it won't feel uncomfortable. Like I really appreciate all the little pieces, like little thoughtful moments that go into it to making this feel like it will be a good fit for everybody. Um, this is very comfortable, softer than I expected. And the beanie is super cute. It has the three stripes in the front, Ivy Park in the back. My hair's kind of crazy. I don't know what it looks like, <laughs> but this is something that I will be wearing. Like I live in LA, it does get hot. Like tomorrow's supposed to be 90 degrees in the middle of November, but on cold days, I will be wearing this. I love it so much. So cute. Like, it's so cute. Okay, next. Okay. So these next pants are the unisex like cargo pants. Look at all the fun details on the leg. Like I love this shiny fabric. It's like gives it just like a little bit more like glammy of a vibe. Um, it's Velcro. So you technically could put real stuff in there if you want to. And then I think all of these are Velcro. Yeah, so these all are real. These are real snaps. I don't know why you would need access to this <laughs> open, but here we go. I really like all the details. I feel like it's super fun. It adds a lot of texture to your outfit. And as it was intended, I feel like this is super gender neutral. Like anybody could wear this and feel super fierce in it. Um, this one doesn't have Velcro, it's just a real pocket. One thing I do like the side pockets are zipped so like you can have it lay a little bit more flat if you're hippie like me but if you're not unzip it it can give it like a different kind of shape a different kind of texture which is fun it is cut different so like the ones that are obviously female are shaped a little bit more you know <laughs> um, form-fitting not like hourglass that's the wrong motion but just like form-fitting these I definitely need to like tighten up here in the waist um, or else they will fall off and my underwear will show. <laughs> like that is definitely gonna happen if I'm not like careful. 
Um, but it's super cute. Love the color. Oh, there's a nip. There's so many pockets. I'll just find endless pockets in these pants, I feel like. Obsessed. Um, super cute. I wanted to get the top that was like kind of cropped, like a cropped sweatshirt. If you know the collection, you know what I'm talking about, but it sold out right before I went to like go purchase. So I got the full look. So I actually have the big sweatshirt too. So I think <laughs> I will be very comfortable, very cozy. Let's try it on. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's very large. <laughs> so I got a 3X bottoms in all my bottoms, but I got a 3X in the sweatshirts too, just cause I always thought, like think like, I like baggy sweatshirts, it's true. But it, maybe when it's unisex, like you don't need to size up like I did. <laughs> um, similar details as the crew neck. It has all these fun little details. I love that the icons are neon in this one. And same little pocket here that I'm going to leave untouched. But yeah, this is really cute. This is something I could wear as a dress. Like, I could absolutely wear this as a dress and, like, belt it. But even not as a dress, it's kind of fun to just, like, I don't know. I feel super cozy, super comfortable. And I would wear this out. This is super cute. Okay, so I also got the neon beanie. It was actually the first one I picked out, and then I decided to get the green one, too. And so it's, like... This can be a full look. <laughs> um, I kind of just feel like I need to be in New York if I'm wearing this. I also kind of feel like I will put nothing on other than this for the next like few months while it's cold here because it's so cozy. It's so comfy. Um, I, I want to wear this every day. Will Paul judge me if I wear this every day? <laughs> um, I kind of do want to try this as a dress. I don't know if this is weird for you too, but here we go. Do -do -do. Okay. Okay, this is long enough. You could totally wear this as like a sweater dress. This is, okay, realistically, this is how I would wear it. And then I'd wear the sweatpants with like, probably like a fitted top. That's realistically how I'd wear it. But you could wear this with boots. You could wear this with sneakers. Like, yay, leave this family happy. This is how I would probably wear it. Yay, okay. Okay, so this is the last look. This is the exact same sweatshirt that I had in like the camel tan color. And I have this belt that I just belted it with if I really wanted to wear it as like a dress. I feel like when you belt it, it gets a little bit shorter. So like, I don't mind it. Like, you know, it's just, my fingertips are right there, but it definitely is like a little bit more scandalous. <laughs> Maybe you can wear like the biker shorts underneath or something like that if you're uncomfortable, but super cute. I would definitely wear this with sneakers. I feel like adorable. I, is that annoying? Like, I feel like, I feel cute. Um, and again, like, Obviously you can take the belt off and it's just super cozy and comfy and not like the going out look or whatever, but like this feels like a little bit more sexy, a little bit more feminine, just belting it at the waist. And yeah, I really feel like, like, I guess we knew that Beyonce doesn't really do wrong. Like, I guess we knew that, but like, I'm really into this. I'm really into the fit. I'm into the feel, it's soft, the quality, the detail, I think she did a great job. I would definitely buy some more from the black collection that's being launched today, um, if you want to, because it's cute. And I feel like I will get a good amount of wear out of this. I was worried when I first bought it that like I was just buying it because Beyonce released it, <laughs> you know, and it's just like spending my money on something that I'm not actually going to wear, but I do feel like I will wear all of these pieces. And that brings me like a little bit more peace because I was like nervous that I just like spent too much money and made a mistake. I don't feel like I made a mistake. I feel very cute. I'm happy with these choices. And I hope this video was like helpful. If you wanted to see what it looked like on a size 22, like a 20, sorry, 20 up top, 22 bottom, 2X on top, 3X on the bottom person. Now you know what the fit is like. Um, hope you enjoyed the video. This is my very first haul. I'll figure this out. Ask any questions below. Let me know if you want me to do anything anything different. I think this is gonna be fun. 
we're definitely going to get into hair stuff. We're going to get into makeup stuff and definitely going to get into more modeling stuff. If there's anything else specifically that you want me to talk about, leave it below in the comments. And until then, we'll see you Friday with Paul.